Right, so a second update vlog. So I did one just down there about the potential stock mower. I'm just gonna do another one now, but be before I go into Huddersfield, and I'm saying this because all the trains all day are not running because of electrical problems. Uh, and it's not just going to Sheffield, it's going other directions as well. Um, so trains are a little bit of a standstill uh, for quite a lot of the day. The, the signal is not going to get fixed until tomorrow. So I think logically for tomorrow, don't even go on the trains either, because then something will happen. Uh, if this is the same thing, it'll be the same at Halifax, it'll be the same at other places as well. Um, they were saying like you can get your train at best from Huddersfield to Stocksmoor, but there's no guarantee of that being a constant service. So they were saying you're best off just not going on a train today. And I'm like, yeah, just fair enough. So they were just like, oh, just, just go into Huddersfield. And I'm like, yeah, so I think what I'm going to do is walk to the John Smith Stadium. Or if you remember it as the Gal Farm Stadium, because that's what it was before John Smith's. And I'm going to probably, yeah, just have a walk to there because like when you walk from here when you walk from like up there to like down here you can see the stadium I mean you can actually you can sort of see the stadium lights from here so I think what I'm going to do is walk to the stadium uh, and then have some dinner later on in Huddersfield because at this time at the moment it's going to be busy in the, the in the town centre because it is lunchtime so if I walk to the stadium first look around the stadium edge not actually to go in but actually go to the stadium uh yeah so i've had a huddersfield day out already in march already so i'm gonna have another one <laughs> so uh yeah gonna enjoy but the thing is i think what i did with huddersfield last time was a focus on like the time lapses and i went particularly into the center oh and the thing is when i was in huddersfield last time one it was snowing one it was snowy icy very busy it was a saturday um whereas like now it's monday it's a monday afternoon so it's going to be a lot lot different so yeah i'm gonna make my way out of huddersfield i literally paid for a trade ticket but it only cost me £2.40, so it's literally, what, £1.20 there and back? £1.20 there, £1.20 back. There's just, I might as well just have a day out in Huddersfield, have like a couple of hours in Huddersfield, have some dinner, uh, and yeah. Because really, one thing you can, one thing you can't really do is have your dinner at lunchtime, because everyone's just packed to hell. So if you wait till like one o'clock or half one, you can kind of, get it when it's quieter so yeah that's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna go to the stadium uh and have a look around so thanks for watching for now and goodbye